Hello, my name is Sakib. I'm an orthopedic registrar from the UK, training in Birmingham. I've been in Cambodia since February 2013, working in the Children's Surgical Centre and the Fidelity Fellowship, and I'm here for six months. Uh, well, Cambodia and working in the Children's Surgical Centre is an immense challenge. Um, I find it both physically, mentally, and emotionally very challenging to deal with the problems of the patients here. It's very uh, sad, so many different um, so many different difficult cases of patients with horrible pathology and not having the ability or the money to have them treated properly. It's very shocking just to constantly see the level of poverty and the level of severe need of these patients. Um, I think a lot of the tumour cases uh, are pretty difficult to deal with. Um, and I think each day you get an unforgettable case and it's bizarre because you think you'll never forget it and then the next day you have another unforgettable case and it just keeps going on and on. So for, for example, just today uh, we had a young girl who was who we think has got a osteosarcoma of her uh, fibula and tibia and she's seven months pregnant and just that in itself, knowing that she's probably got a very poor prognosis of survival is quite shocking in itself, just to having to deal with that. And then that just follows on from another case two days ago of you know, a severe spinal injury and that patient is now paralyzed. Um, and it just goes on and on. So I think every day is almost unforgettable to an extent where you forget the day before. Well, uh, you, I've always believed that you can learn from every, every member of staff in an institution. And Cambodia is no different. It's a great level of experience of the surgeons. Um, and I've learned a lot from, from their surgical technique and experience but also some of their ways of improvisation because they're dealing with, on a day-to-day -day basis for a number of years, really difficult pathology, stuff that you'd never dream of seeing in the UK. And also dealing with that difficult pathology in difficult circumstances with not always the right kit, if that, if that makes sense. So how they improvise and deal and come with a solution to a problem that you know is very difficult is something you can always learn from, learning improvisation, surgical, Way of techniques of getting around a difficult situation. And I think that level of improvisation is what I'm learning. And also how to become effective with your resources. So like in my past practice, I'd probably you know, waste my sutures or not really take care of my instruments. But here you realize that's the only suture you've got and that's the only instrument you've got. And you have to um, manage your resources really, really well to become cost effective. I've learned that from working in such a poor setting. Working in Cambodia definitely makes you a lot more humble. You appreciate what you have, both as a human being, but also as a surgeon. You appreciate what you have in the UK, all the resources that you've got. And therefore, you're a lot more um, grateful to both um, the healthcare that you can provide, but also you're a lot more humble to your patients.